So basically, one part of the immune system is very important part is called T cells, and these T cells circulate in the blood and try to find uh, bad cells and chronic infected cells, try to kill them. The problem with malignant tumors is they actually deactivate this very important part of the immune system, the T cells, and they deactivate it by overexpressing multiple receptors and surface of these receptors and these cells. So our hope is to block these receptors and in the meantime unleash the immune system to recognize and cure cancer. The beauty of this research is it is not targeting one cancer. It's not for breast cancer only or lung cancer or brain cancer. It is basically unleashing the immune system to discover what is wrong in the, in the body. Any type of cancer basically will offer patients with an affordable, cheap, and accessible treatment. On Immune Checkpoints was started last year and funded by the, by the AVI. It was started by Harlot and Lorne Terrell and myself and it's been heavily funded by the AVI. We're absolutely delighted that the Alberta Cancer Foundation agrees with us that this offers real hope for cancer sufferers. And so this program, I'm quite sure with the talented team that's been assembled, will deliver small molecule drugs that are safer and less expensive and therefore can get to the people that really need them. Not only does this uh, outstanding research partnership include the potential to have a profound impact on cancer treatment and patient outcomes, it will further solidify the reputation of the University of Alberta as a leader in translational science and research excellence. I understand that this is the largest grant ever received by the Faculty of Pharmacy and Pharmaceutical Sciences. We look forward to learning about the outcomes and Im impact of your exciting and innovative work. Thank you.